What's going on guys? It's Mike Gray. What's going on guys? We're here with an episode of Gray's Challenge. We got two talented photographers here with us today. Hey, I'm Bex. I am a New York born and bred photographer. I'm a portrait, commercial, and set stills photographer. What's going on, man? My name is Demorier, man. I'm from South Central LA. I've been a photographer for eight years, and I'm a portrait photographer. Um, I'm ready, man. You I'm sure? excited. I'm really excited, to be honest. Do you know anything that's about to happen? At all, nothing. Okay, so I will nothing. I will say that Bex came locked and loaded, ready to go. Had the had the Sony strap, had, <laughs> had the whole thing, whole get up, the bag, all of that. And I, I had bring, to. I didn't bring nothing. Yeah, you, <laughs> I didn't bring any, anything. Confidence, confidence. I'm, so, I'm sorry I had to let you down. That's but. fine. That's fine. First, you guys will Rochambeau. The winner of rock oh, yeah. paper scissors will get to call heads or tails for the coin toss. Shoot. Want to shoot? Okay. Yeah, rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Ready? Okay. Rock, rock paper, paper, scissors, shoot. Woo! That's two out of three. Okay. That's Ready? two out of three. Okay. Woo! Ooh. You can't go wrong with rock. I ain't gonna lie to you. Uh, okay. <laughs> Ooh, what a way to go. <laughs> Heads or tails? Oh, head, baby. Heads? Heads. Uh. Woo! Tails. God damn. All right. And in so, the end. you guys both will be shooting on the Pentax 6-7 today. Option one, you will be taking portraits. You have 10 frames, which is a full roll of 120 film. So you have 10 minutes to go out on the street, find a model, and shoot them in 10 minutes. 10 shots, 10 minutes. Now, you can space it out. Maybe it may take you five minutes to find somebody, and then another five, you can go ham. What is going to tell the story, okay? Option B, more of a street photography vibe. So maybe you're taking a photo of a car bumper. Maybe you're taking a photo of a trash can. Maybe you're taking a photo of the environment, people on the street, whatever that may be to you, whatever tells the story to you guys. But because you don't have to worry about going up and approaching people, you only get five frames in 10 minutes. So you have five strong frames to tell the story that you want to tell. You're the winner. Mm -hmm. What do you choose? Option A or option B? I'm going to choose option A. Outstanding. Okay. <laughs> you didn't That's expect what's up. that? Okay. That's what's up. Okay. Okay. I was hoping for the portrait. I was hoping for the portrait. Are you comfortable? I'm comfortable with anything. I'm Are you right. comfortable? I'm going to have to be. Okay. <laughs> B is five frames, five minutes. No, no, no. Five, five frames, ten minutes. Ten minutes, strictly environmental. Yes. No subject, just environmental. I'm going to stick by. I'm going to stick beside him. I'm going to stick beside him. Okay. okay. I'm stick beside him. I'm okay. Stick with a. <laughs> All right. Well, um, without further ado, let's get it going. So look, I really don't do street photography like that. So I don't know how it's going to turn out for me, man, but I'm going to have to do what it do. You know what I'm saying? We a photographer, we got to adapt. You know what I'm saying? Now, my challenger, I think she's going to do pretty okay, but I don't know. She might not find somebody in time, so we're going to see, though. So how I feel about the challenge, I feel like portraiture is my place of comfort, but the challenge of finding somebody randomly and then telling a story on top of that, I'm a little nervous. I'm a little nervous, 10 minutes only, and I've never shot film. <laughs> so let's see how this turns out. <laughs> but I'm happy my challenger is also challenged. Okay. This is the shutter button. Okay. And then every after you take a picture, you wind this all the way for the new, for the new frame. Okay. And three, two, one. Fight. Go! You better get the walking, girl. <laughs> what you, you say? You better get the walking. <laughs> Hold on, actually, Mike. Backpack off. Phone to your phone to the pocket. I, I did ask if I could use anybody, right? I did, right? Yeah, I mean, if you want to, if you want to cheat. Hmm? Now, He's a person on the street. You sure you don't, you want to do it right here? Or where, where I already see my lines, okay. I see my shadows, I see, yeah. Damn, what a <laughs> turn of events. Okay. You Man, use all 10 shots on Mike? Shit. Damn, that's some huh? cheating stuff, ain't it? <laughs> Are you all using all the shots on him? That would be crazy. Woo, 
Okay. First shot. First shot. Okay. Have you lean up against this standing? <laughs> okay. Because you gotta be accurate with it. You gotta make sure that thing is on it, like sharp right, on it. Lean. lean back kind of like lean back and let this arm elongate with the lines okay. and the staircase. Oh, you hear that? She says, let the arm <laughs> elongate with the lines. You know what she's talking about. Oh, here, I'll let Demorier, I'll let you, I'll let you hold that. Dang, I wish it was like a preview of what the shot could look like. So, yeah, you got it. That's perfect. All right. Nice. You feel your exposure is all of that is good? Is it? No, I'm asking you. Uh-uh, 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 Mike. Trying. See, <laughs> he look, he, he <laughs> trying to, I think he's rooting for happen. her. That's what is going on. Is that a foul? That's a foul right there. You can't be saying yeah. stuff like that. Back up, back up. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Dang, I'm so used to like. Damn. Okay. So here, it kind of <laughs> let the sun really be onto your face. Okay. You want to go hat off real quick? My, my head looks crazy right okay, now. Okay, it's fine, it's fine. A little, a little off, back. yeah. And then eyes closed. Let me see what that looks like. That's beautiful. I'm looking forward to see who she's going to for sure. Oh, that's beautiful. All right. Hey, she got me feeling like, <laughs> <laughs> feeling like Mona Lisa. <laughs> Real quick. She got five oh, minutes. Oh, she really using all of them on me. How yeah. many minutes does she have? Five. Five? Are you okay with sitting if you need to? Absolutely. Okay. And then we'll work on expression. I like the way that you like, just like that, and you kind of was connecting with me. Beautiful. Okay. Good connection. I'm fine. I'm not crying. You're crying. <laughs> you got three. Yeah. Tilt your head to the right and down. Yes. Oh, that's it. That timer up. What's what? Timer is up. It's up. It's done. Give your respect. Oh. She's done. Oh. Oh. I think that last one was was money though. So I'm not. Oh. That was crazy. You was, you was catching the groove too though, right? You liked it. I liked it. I don't know what I tried. <laughs> I hope that the exposure worked out, but I went more for feel. Okay. Feel and story. I wasn't expecting that. Great job. Thank you. Demorier, how do you feel? Right <laughs> Were you expecting that? Oh yeah, man. I'll take the bag so you okay. can get ready for your, your, Look. your bout. I was not expecting that. I get. I ain't gonna lie. That was a pretty smart move. I'm not gonna lie to you. But uh, <laughs> do you? But do you feel that she sold herself self short by not going on Fairfax? A little Miami? bit. A little bit. I was looking kind of excited to see who she's gonna pull out. You know what I'm saying. But it is what it is. She, you know what I'm saying. Found her little way out there and <laughs> did her thing. You know what I'm saying. So three, two, one, go. Yeah, <laughs> we going this way. Ah. <sighs> It's a beautiful day out here in Los Angeles, you know what I'm saying? Nice and sunny. He has 10 minutes, so for five shots, keep in mind, five shots. We got this, baby. If I was him, I would take five minutes to figure out what I was gonna shoot, but, you know. I just want to frame it up real quick. Hold on. We're gonna do, we're gonna do F8. We're gonna overexpose a little bit. I'm biased, but I can respect a good landscape, so it just depends on how good it is. 125, see, cool. See how he uses the colors and the flowers. Already going for line. He's going for line. Yeah, you see what he's going for? Mm -hmm. Okay. That's one. I think he knows exactly what he's doing. He went for lines and color just now, probably in closer range of the sky. So that's that what I do. That's what I do. Crazy. He's already using the light meter, so that balance is going to be beautiful. <laughs> And that's like my biggest worry is to see how how our light shows up in each of our photos. Oh yeah, he yeah. What a find! What did he find? Oh my! He got the Porsche. Let's go. It says eight, but we're gonna overexpose a little bit. I'm gonna go five six. That's gonna be sick. That's gonna be sick. I can tell. Oh my God! Look at all those lines. I 
I felt that one. <laughs> F11. I always overexpose, so we're going F8. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. I like how the Porsche is next to the little Honda. He's on to something right here. Yeah. Now, I wouldn't use all of my frames at this one spot, but, you know, we'll see what he does. We got two more. You're four minutes in, so you got plenty of time. I heard that. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> I'm feeling a little good right now. <laughs> You're really coming out. Okay, okay. <laughs> Time? It's four minutes and 42 seconds. All right. Two more frames, four minutes. I think that's enough. Um, we want to pick it up a little bit though, if I want to get on the street. So let's get a little, let's get a little, let's get a little jog going, you know what I'm saying? Hold on. Let's see what this look like. Mm-hmm. He's going for the story, the texture. He's going for it. I like how there's private properties right here, but there's a bed and building. So I'm gonna go to eight. One more shot. How many frames are you in? Mm -hmm. Got one more. Well, sir, you're at six minutes and 12 seconds, so. You know what I'm saying? Sometimes you gotta play the hand you just do. And that's what we out here for. <laughs> it's my cardio for the day, baby. It's my cardio for the day. I was about to hit the gym today, but shit, we in the gym now. <laughs> we here. Nine minutes and 29 seconds. Nine minutes and 29 seconds. Oh, shit. 19. Eight. Six, eight. Finish <laughs> Got it. I think I think it was worth it for him to run and get life, life, texture, color, people in his environmental portrait. I think it was worth it for the run. I see what he was doing. Five frames. Yeah. How do you, how do you feel about your five frames? Fantastic. Wow. Great. Wow. I was getting a little groove. I was getting a little rhythm. Find out. As soon as I find out rhythm, I couldn't stop. So that eye. Do you feel that the limited amount of frames that you got? which is five, hindered how your photos will come out? Or do you actually feel like it was easier for your process because you didn't have as many to shoot? I think it was easier because I only had five frames. So I could take my time, find the right shots. I didn't have to rush 10 shots. So I felt good about it, you know what I'm saying? Oh! <laughs> Congratulations to the two of you. <laughs> this has been an episode of Gray's Challenge. I hope you guys enjoyed this. Mm -hmm. What's your Instagram handle, YouTube handle? Demoria Walker and Demoria Walker on YouTube, man. Bex Francois, B-E-X-X-F-R-A-N-C-O-Y-S dot com, at Instagram, Twitter, everything, Bex Francois. You guys will find their information in the description below. I hope y'all enjoyed this, and I'll see y'all in the office. What's going on guys? I hope you enjoyed this challenge video. Shouts out to Beck, shouts out to DeMaurier. These two photographers were dealt with some challenges, some roadblocks, and I think that they overcame them very well. Uh, for Bex, man, first off, she had never shot film before. I don't even think my first roll of film even came out, to be honest. Comment below if, if you guys had results your first roll of film um because i know i damn sure didn't so shouts out to bex and demorier is a fire ass portrait photographer he isn't too fond of landscapes and environmental shots so i think that it was good that both of them uh stepped outside of their comfort zone to crush it you already know it was only right we shot on the pentax 67 with the kodak portrait 400 both shooters had and you know me i really don't give a damn about the the film rules so you could edit your photos however you want whatever you felt would give you the best results there are so many photographers and i truly want to meet all y'all but i know i can't but this gives me the opportunity and the platform to meet as many people as I can, especially if you're in L.A. So this was the first episode of many. The production value will go up. I promise you with that. So keep in mind that, you know, we just getting started. So, yeah, just just be a little easy on us. Which photographer did you resonate with? Now, it's not about who won or who lost, 
but which photographer's photos did you guys resonate with the most? You know, art is subjective and it's not about whose work was better because it's not that. First off, this is two totally different styles of shooting and each photographer has a different eye. So I want you guys to comment below uh, whose photos did you guys resonate with and why? So don't put who without putting the why. And if you guys were in that situation, would you have chosen option A or option B? Curious to know. But yes, both photographers did such an amazing job. And without further ado, I think it's time. We got, and this isn't a big giveaway. Keep in mind, don't be, oh, he just giving a couple. No, because the real giveaways come during Christmas. Right now, it's about to be Halloween. So take it easy on me, y'all. Who's gonna complain at free film? Because we got some of the Cinestill 50D film. This isn't the 400D, the new daylight. This is the 50D. So, but this is fresh. It's been in my fridge. We got four boxes, four rolls, 120, uh, not expired. I will be choosing from the comments below. If you guys want a four pack of some Cinestill 50D to add to the arsenal, while film prices are still high, comment below and I will be announcing the lucky winner in next week's video. I hope y'all enjoyed this one. Please like it if you rocked with it. Subscribe to the channel and I will see y'all on the next one. We out.